Welcome to the O'Brien Shade Basics. Lighting conditions. Lighting changes everything, and lighting is important in shade photography. If you go to the hardware store, the paint department will often have a display showing how colors look very different under different types of light sources. This phenomenon is called metamerism, and I talk about it in another video. But what is true for house paint is also true for tooth color. When taking the initial shade or any shade photograph, room and lighting conditions are an important consideration. Yes, the dual source flash on your DSLR camera will help with inaccuracies for the photo. But in the initial determination of the shade, when you're looking at the patient and have that shade guide in front of them, here are some things to keep in mind. Installation of full spectrum lighting where the shades are taken is critical. And this next one often gets missed. Always take your shade pre-op when the teeth are fully hydrated. Teeth begin to dehydrate rapidly and post-op teeth lose their translucency and appear lighter and brighter than they actually are. Shades taken post-op are seldom accurate and how much shade will change once the teeth rehydrate is anyone's guess. Move the operatory light away from the patient. Do not shine it in their face. Make sure the patient is in diffused light with no bright light or direct shadows. Be aware of colored or tinted office windows. Use a shade to cover windows if necessary to block excess light on sunny days and have enough corrected lighting to make up for cloudy days. A consistent setting helps remove some of the variables that frustrate accurate, repeatable shade matching. And those colorful gloves, they affect what we see. Use only very light blue, white, or neutral colored gloves and always have a shade tab represented in the photo. Even if it's a difficult shade to determine or lighting variations are present, having a point of reference for the lab gives us a standard to compare the teeth to. So, look at your lighting, see what can be changed. Those small changes can make accurate shades more predictable, repeatable, and excellent. Until next time, I'm Mitch for O'Brien Dental Lab.